All right, I want to lock in because on Friday, Julio Rodriguez signed a massive extension. We didn't get a chance to talk about it when we came off the air. So you want to talk, first off, just dive in on the face. You're telling me there's not a... It's in the un, eyes for you. You always say that. It's in the eyes, people. There's some good energy happening right here. This is what a superstar looks like. Talking about community. Get me to the sound from his press conference. and Just listen to this, can we? I'm just happy to be a Mariner for as long as I can. Happy to you guys for giving me the opportunity to change my family's life. Not today, but uh, 2017 when you guys gave me the opportunity. And, I, and since that day, I felt committed to you guys. I mean, handsome is all get out. The suit's on point, mm -hmm. the no tie, everything is just working. He is a superstar. And Seattle, you got yourselves one of the best players in the game for the next potential, oh his God. entire career. Here's Sean Manaya little change up middle in that he absolutely destroys oh. and I wanted to break him down a little bit because I see a lot of superstar type players that he matches up with okay flair for the dramatic he just announced the contract the guaranteed 210 million he goes out there he knocks a donut off his bat he gets a standing ovation and he doesn't disappoint the fans and goes bridge that next night, Saturday night, which is pretty unbelievable, okay? To see all those guys go to his press conference was amazing. All his teammates in there just speaks to volumes of what this kid's about, character-wise, leadership-wise. So I want to get a little side angle rip real quick, okay? Hold on. Pause this. Bring up the players that have 20 homers, 20 stolen bases, and a 115-plus OPS real quick, guess, Rod? Take a look at this. In age 21 season, last 35 years, you got J-Rod, Ronald Acuna, look at Trout, Jay up unbelievable. I mean, superstars in the game. So he's impacting you, get back into the tape real quick. He's impacting you offensively, playing a premium position center field. Oh, by the way, he steals bags. Just a phenomenal, phenomenal player. But when I watch him hit, he does a lot of things right at the plate, really. Just special type talent. I want a side angle of his, of his swing, and then we're gonna break it down, okay? Run it. Pause. Bring it back. All the way. All the way, come on. Right there, it's a very subtle kind of load. Create that rubber band effect. The hips start going, but the shoulders, the shoulders stay square, okay? I always felt one of the best right-handed swings in the game when I was playing was Alex Rodriguez. He did everything right. You can get through this and get me to an A-Rod in Texas, please. I mean, that is creating leverage. This is perfection for me when I was watching. Run that back for me real quick, okay? Three things I always talked about. Get the weight to the inside of the back knee. The head doesn't move too much. And take the hands to the ball. The bat head replaces the hands. And that's what A-Rod did better than anybody. The thing I notice now in this A-Rod with the Yankees, a little bit bigger, a little bit wider base. He's got a little Mookie in his swing too. Run that back for me real quick. So you got, pause it. You got this start high hands and kind of this lean in and you'll see Mookie's hips start to go, but he never loses his front shoulder so he doesn't get rotational. So it's this kind of lean in, bang, down, the hips start to go and I stay, through the baseball. So he's kind of got a little bit of what A-Rod did at the plate, a little bit of what Mookie did at the plate. You mash them up together, six foot four, 225 pounds of athleticism. Now he doesn't have to worry about a thing financially for the rest of his life, only gonna get better. And then whenever you're on a board just with Byron Buxton, you know you're doing something. Players in the 90th percentile are better, hard hit percentage, defensively outs above average, and then the average sprint speed. It's him and Buxton. So we didn't get a chance. We came off the air on Friday, yeah. and he signed that big deal. But he's going to look good in the playoff game.